What's up, everyone? Welcome back to MP Dog How's everyone going? I'm back out here in Austin, Texas, doing some creek fishing. I'm out here with my brother Jensi. He's chilling out there trying to catch some bass, but we're at Bull Creek in Austin, Texas. I got the waterfall behind me, and we got a nice little creek to explore. So I got the shoes off, and we're gonna wade the creek. So we're just gonna walk down as far as we can and come back. Um, I think we just, I got one spinning rod and my brother has one spinning rod, so uh, we're gonna see how many bass we can catch or cichlids, uh, panfish, so. All right, let's get to fishing. All right, we're gonna try a slim shake worm. Guggenbait slim shake worm. This is pretty big for this hook, but it will entice these bass, I'm pretty sure. All right, let's get in there. There's a couple of bass coming towards it. Small ones though. He's still chilling right there. He's looking at my bait. Oh, he's looking at my bait now. He's coming towards it. Coming towards my bait. Uh. Watching it, he's interested. He's like, huh, should I eat it? Should I not? Let's see, he's still chilling right there. There he goes. Just saw it drop. Come on, come on. Put it in your mouth, there you go. Got it. <clears throat> Got him. Woohoo! there we go. Oh, he just tore up the Guggenbase. Nice, got you, buddy. I'm not gonna let you fall. Oh, nice. First bass in this creek, in Bull Creek. Look at that, look how beautiful this looks. Awesome. That is what I'm talking about. I'm lean over this rock. Got one. <laughs> nice. Wow. Another bass. I didn't think he was gonna eat that big of one. Oh, he went underneath the hole. All right, come out. Dang, he's bigger than I thought. Nice. I'm telling you, Gen C, tied to a worm. Woo! We're on him, man. Look at that. Beautiful. Look at that. Look how big that worm is. Ow! His teeth are sharp, man. Look how big that worm is compared to him. Nice, that action though. Sharp. They're really sharp, dude. All right. Beautiful bass. Let's get this guy back in. He's feisty. I'm actually probably gonna move along the side right here, maybe climb up those rocks. The only thing is I'm, I'm barefoot right now, so it's gonna be kind of difficult. That being it's slick and hard to climb up, so. I'm just going to move along right here on the edge. Ooh, ooh, one blew up on it. Got him, got him. Nice, it was that same one I saw before. Ooh, he's a nice one too. Decent size one, about the same size as the other ones. Ooh, oh no, this is a big one. Yeah, woo! That's what I'm talking about, baby. Look at that. 
That's a two and a half pounder. Nice, that's what I'm talking about. Right underneath those trees. Man, they got some sharp teeth. Yes, that's what I'm talking about, man. Biggest one I've caught in Austin. That is awesome. He blew up on it. Sick, let me let him go in the sunlight over here. All right, that got me excited. Oh, that was a nice catch. Woo! All right, let's see if we can get some more. Oh, he was underneath right here. I see I see two more over there. I see a bed over there. Pretty sure that's not a, a bass bed, but... Oh, another one just blew up on it. Woo-hoo! Same spot. Little feisty guy. Nice. Oh, God, quick release. Nice, woo, same spot. There's like a little bed right there. I see like four or five just swimming around it. All right. Well, we're on them today, man. I like this creek so far. This is Bull Creek in Austin, Texas. So you just gotta find your way down to this creek. We had to kind of climb down, but find an opening, there's fish down here. Definitely try it underneath this right here. Dude, this looks deeper right here. Oh, what was that? You see that? Something jumped. Might have been a turtle. Oop, got one. Oh, no, it was a bite. That was a bite, definitely. Oh, oh, got one. Woo, look how small he is. <laughs> nice. This one might be a little bit shinier. So I think they like the darker color. Yeah, you might as well switch to the darker color. Yeah. Let's get this guy off. Awesome. What's that little guy? You must have been hungry. It's a big worm, buddy. It's almost the size of you. All right. Look at that. It is, it is almost the size of him. Look at that. Yeah. It's insane. They're hungry. All right, little guy. Appreciate it. Noise. All right. All right, Jensi. You need to catch one, bro. <laughs> okay. Got one? Got one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah nice. He got one. Of course, he got a crappy reel, but he's getting it in. He's getting in. Oh, nice. He's jumping. Let's see if we can double up. Nice. Yes. My brother got his first bass. Awesome. Decent size. Bigger than the first one I caught. Awesome, bro. Barely hooked. Well, no, uh, I'm even feeling for a sec. That was just a yeah, He's probably coming towards you. Yeah. He's like, I don't know which way to go. All right, my brother's about to release his fish. There we go. Nice. That was a nice one. Yeah, this is pretty shallow. Is there, is there a bigger section after that, you think, or no? I guess we should just find out real quick. Huh? About to find out. Came to this part, it's getting really shallow, so we're gonna see, and there's, look, looks like there's some rapids over here, so we're gonna go past that and see if there's a, a big opening over here.
dude. Oh my God. Jincy. There's a snapping turtle like this big, bro. Bro, come here. Look at him, sitting underneath that rock perfectly. He's looking right at us. Bro, that's what I thought, and I was like, wait. I saw it move. He's looking right at us, dude. I don't know if you guys can make it out, probably not, but there's a huge snapping turtle down there. He's looking right at us. Let me see if I can get an underwater shot without scaring him, but I really don't want to walk by. I don't, yeah, he's going to bite my hand off, bro. Look how big he is. Oh my gosh. He's like, get away from my freaking spot. Shit. Almost fell. Where'd he go? Oh, one just hit mine right when it dropped. It's too small though. Got my brother swimming. He's like, screw it. He tried to get his hook out. He couldn't get it. <laughs> Bro, that's hilarious. We both lost our hooks and we, we left our tackle box on their side. So we got to go get it. <laughs> He's like, screw it. That's gonna be it for today. Me and my brother are ready to pack it in. We're getting real hungry. But uh, obviously we had a really good day. I had a good, really good day. I'm not sure how many bass I caught. I think I caught like five or six, but caught a real decent one of two and a half pounders. But man, I was, that's, this finding new creeks is what I love to do. And especially around here in Austin, just exploring for the first time in these creeks is just just so much fun. It really was challenging just walking in bare feet in the, in the creek bed, because those little rocks, over time, just really kill your feet, and my feet are really torn up right now. I really regret not bringing uh, some water shoes. Like I said before, this is Bull Creek, and if you guys want to come check it out, it's uh, you just have to find a little trail that comes down to the creek and just walk it. I suggest uh, wading it and walking down like we did, because there's different bass underneath uh, different parts of the shades and different parts of the cliff, so uh, come in and try it out. All right, so that's going to do it. Uh, my brother Jitsi has something to say. Yeah, anyway, hit that like button, subscribe for more, hit that notification bell when I get my videos up. Try to do it every week, it gets a little hard with the editing, but uh, keep at it, and uh, as always, stay with. that rock too?